I've just had an amazing idea. I'm going to regret this. What is your amazing idea, Claire Ward? Let's start a boy band. You can be the lead singer, Percy can do the harmonics. Oh, I'm good. And I can do the raps. What kind of raps? Well, Robo Chris, if they ever actually do form a boy band, you have my permission to zap them. <laughs> Copy that. Copy that? Hey Smeggies. Chris, where's Robo Chris staring at us? He's making sure that you lot are not creating a boy band. There's enough in this world already. True, in fact. That is why we're not creating one. Good. Now tell me, do you guys have a new episode? What do you do? We do. Are you ready, Claire Wood? I'm ready. One, a two, a one, two, three. Well, I did give him permission. <laughs> Moving on. I've now been a 40 year old for more than half a year. I know, I know, I don't look like it, but I want to share with you all the changes I've had to deal with. Like grey hair? Fred, I've had grey hairs for years, and I don't really care about it anyway. Where are you going? Robo Chris destroyed our video, so I'm going to walk off in a huff. Ah, well, huff away then. Back to what I was saying. And I'm not just talking about the changes to myself, but also to the way I perceive the world around me. Perceive? Is that like Percy's full name? He's how he thinks you're doing work. Here are some examples. Walking up the stairs takes a little bit longer. I do have a bad knee. I find it a little bit more difficult to get out of bed. My hand to eye coordination is a little off. You off. When I'm vlogging, holding up my camera all the time gets a little bit tiring. Uh, my arms are aching from holding you guys up. But I've got Robo Chris to hold you up, so everything's working out fine. <sighs> Apart from the pain in my arms. Weak. Music has suddenly seemed louder. My laptop seems to be a bit brighter than the sun. Suddenly I'm good at darts. Ow! Oh, sorry mother. Well, almost. My memory has gotten worse. <sighs> oh yeah, I moved my sofa. Last year. Why did I go in the fridge again? Huh, I wonder what day it is. I talk to myself more. I don't know if it's have beans or rice or soup or chicken. Or maybe there's something in the fridge. But am I really that hungry? Well, my stomach is gurgling. But is it gurgling out of hunger? Well, yeah, it's rumbling. I, I need food. I'm very, very hungry. I'm saying that I'm hungry and I've got to eat now. Let me have some food. I seem to enjoy nature more, like the wind in my face. It would seem that I'm more mature. <laughs> Maybe not. Oh, and naps have become a thing. Five more minutes. 
And I'm sure there are more, I just can't remember them. I don't care what you say, it's time for me to rap. <sighs> he never learns. Anyway, it's time for me to go. Thanks for watching and subscribing if you have. Until the next time, peace out. Uh, I think it's nap time again. Okay, I might have exaggerated a little bit about the things that have happened to me since I turned 40. But not all of them. Getting up the stairs is getting a bit more difficult. But then I've always had a bad knee. Usually I just run straight up and I can still do that. I just can't be bothered. I'm too lazy. I think that's another symptom of turning 40. For me anyway. But I don't know. I think it's just something in the mind about when you turn 40 you're expected to be more, I don't know, mature and and able to know things, be more wise. It's not true. And you know that expression about act your age? I don't know how to, I've never been this age before. But I always go on that other saying, you're as old as you feel. And it's true because sometimes you, you get so energetic and happy and excited like, you know, a kid at Christmas, that you just start running around and being all giddy. Well, I do, especially when it comes to geeky things. And of course, there are those days where I feel like I'm actually just 40 and I just want to go to sleep. Like right now. Yeah, I'm definitely going for a nap now. Ta da! I might be 40, but I'm still doing my own stunts. <laughs> <laughs>